Hello, my name is Nathan, and welcome to Shin Megami Tensei 5 Vengeance. Now, hopefully I pronounced that right, but let's get right into this. Been pretty excited to play it. Love me some monster catching games kind of thing. And I've dabbled in the series a little bit. Of course, Persona being kind of adjacent to it. And then I've played Devil Survivor 1 and 2 on the DS. Uh, that's been a while, but I'm just excited to start a new game. Hmm. I think we'll just do a normal playthrough, right? Yeah, we'll do normal. Yes. Yes. For the third time. Kind of interesting they have to say that. When I contemplate the brevity of man's life, I'm indifferent to worldly things. How many are the days I spent in thought? Wow. Amazing. Long ago, the world of order was created by God, and his servants, the angels, led it on its proper course. It was in such a world that countless mortals led happy, fruitful, and prosperous lives by his grace. However, even God's world is not eternal. I like how you can tell who the main characters are. The pure, unsullied path that God had forged will, as fate dictates, become a muddled, poisonous swamp at the hands of humankind. Disrupted order begets chaos, and chaos will likewise be consumed by order in turn. How will these keepers of knowledge strive and perish during their final futile hours in this doomed world? Let us watch them at our leisure until the new ruler is seated upon the throne. Now these games are always seem a little intense. I remember Devil Survivor what being kind of like that. A passing soul. This is a path linked to the future. The choices you make will affect the very course of the world. Oh, okay. Thought I was just going to school. But yeah, it's like a lot of religion, a lot of devils, a lot of angels. So it's, it's very intense. Also with schools, always with schools. Stay your hand now. The soul of that girl cannot be permitted to exist. By her very nature, she will lead the world into chaos and ruin. She must remain sealed here for all eternity. To take the girl from this place will lead not to the future destined for this world, but to a world yet unknown. Knowing only this, will you still take her hand? I guess so. Yeah, we'll do it.
Thank you. Foolish soul. Do not forget that with a simple gesture, your decision has hastened the end of the world. We can only pray that you return to the proper path. That you find your way again. Are these the bad people? They're trying to make sure things are... Oh. My headphones. Why? Alright, give me... <laughs> give me one second. Alright, so I looked it up and uh, Vengeance has a new story, which I didn't even know. I just thought it was like a re-release so they can get it off the Switch. But um, if I take the hand, it does the new story. Uh, a lot of people recommend not taking the hand as your first playthrough. Um, I guess if you do take the hand, it'll be a little harder. I think I get to make a, a choice again right after this. Uh, but I think I'm actually going to take the hand. Uh, it seems like... Why would they add this new story if they didn't want it to be played? Um, I mean, they're not really telling me one way or another, so let's see. Yes, we'll start with that. So, but I guess in the original story, uh, they actually still added things, new monsters, all that kind of stuff. Uh, but this will have new features and things, so I'm going to do it. All right. Listen up. Everyone should have their own personal tablets now, but it sounds like some of you still need to get them registered. Those temp accounts are about to expire. So anyone who's been putting it off better get on that. All right, first name, we'll do AZ. I think that name works well for male or female, you know? I like it. It's like a nickname. My last name, wasn't really expecting this. Um, <laughs> I'm just gonna do my handle, cards, AZ cards. Yep, name is Okie Dokie. One other thing. It's been getting pretty dangerous out there. Remember the buddy system. Go back to the dorm in groups. That's it for homeroom. Thank you, sir. All right, hopefully we get a play soon. Students were advised to head home in groups. You should look for a classmate to walk with. The mini map's displayed in the lower left and gives you information on surroundings. A talk symbol indicates someone that can be spoken to, or a speech bubble. You can approach these individuals and press A to speak with them. By pressing y, y in the field, you can open the menu to save your progress and adjust gameplay settings. The various functions of the menu will be unlocked as the game progresses. When saving the field is possible, you can do so by pressing left on the D-pad. It's recommended you save often. Good old-fashioned RPGs. Ooh, we can even do a little save scumming. Cool. All right. Just making sure there's no screen tearing. Doesn't look like there is. Hey there. You know, I think the biggest name at school has got to be... Okay, first of all... Just so you guys know, you can correct me, of course. I'm bad at pronouncing things. Uh, especially Japanese names. So, Yuzuru. Uh, uh, let's see. <laughs> but in terms of girls, it'd be Tao Izanakami, right? She's smart, great athlete, nice. Hey. She's got it all. Hey, I'm smart. I'm athletic. I'm nice. These students are too busy talking. Doesn't seem like you can walk home with any of them. And they're also, they don't have main character energy because she doesn't even have eyeballs. So, so it looks like we've got those guys probably don't say anything. None of these guys do. Hey, Here, hey. let's see. Oh, speaking of all the scary stuff, I heard a first year got attacked near the station. Apparently the shadow huh? came right at her. Shadow? What do well, you mean? 
I mean, there's that's how she described it. She said some kind of black fog tore her bag up. But then apparently some girl wearing a St. Marina high uniform saved her. No way. That sounds like something out of an anime. Ha <laughs> ha. If only. Wait, was that? What am I what am I talking to right here? Can I talk to them all the way from here? Hey. I guess so. Hey, so you talking to that geek from the next class over? Uh, what's his name? Ichiro Dazai? Dazai? Yeah. Man, I'm so sorry, you guys. We're going to call him D. Yeah, I guess he's making videos trying to put together this web series. Ask me about that slasher incident at the hmm. tunnel. All right, that stuff about some invisible guy with a knife makes, makes you wonder what the real story <laughs> is there. Yeah, it seemed like that was D's point. Said he's going to solve the mystery of the slasher in the tunnel. Really hyping himself up, you know. Yep, too busy. Sometimes a... Uh, uh, Looks like a GPS marker symbol will be displayed on the minimap. This is an objective marker that indicates where you should go next, and reaching this marker will advance the main story. Make your way to these locations when you're ready to progress. All right. Everything all right? Hey, you want to walk home together? Uh, going home in a group sounds like a right pain in the ass. I'm just going to go <sighs> it alone. Oh. If you can't find anyone else, maybe you should go do the same, huh? Wow. I decided to go home by myself as well. Hey, you heading back alone? Nice. Yurizu Tsuta. <laughs> I hope you guys don't mind me butchering the names. I'm just going to have fun with it. To go home in groups, right? You should walk with us. Yeah, we're main character energy. We have eyeballs. We can see. Oh. You know what? Sure. Oh, hey, you two, over here. Maybe they'll say their names so I can figure it out. Oh, um, hi there. I didn't know you knew him, Miyazu. I mean, not really. Him? They've met in Are we a boy? I think Miyazu and I ran into him a couple times. Yato, something like that. Aww, you're lucky your big brother looks out for you so much, huh? Um, I guess. We're the only family we've got. I don't think it's that strange to look out for my little sister. <laughs> sure, sure. So, how about we all walk home together? All right. AZ attends, uh, Joan's high school? Oh, it looks like there's some little screen tearing. Not too far from there, he lives at the Joan High School dormitory, along with the other students. Oh, I thought the main character was a girl. Hmm. It doesn't matter. In the commute to and from school, the shortest route is to pass through the connecting passageway at Shingo Shinagawa Station. Quick way back to the dorm, we'll be head to the Shingo Shinagawa Station West exit. Boy. Oh, I'm actually walking. Here, I'm going to see about... If there's something I hate, it's screen tearing. Let's see if the... Guess we'll just turn on V-Sync. I actually don't like it because it's a delay, but this is an RPG, so it doesn't matter. Well, it looks like we can talk to some people, you know? Like, what is this? Ah, this place is getting so dangerous. Okay. Looks like they're just here to block us. Monsters in the city, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Oh, right. Tao, you said you wanted to talk about something? Oh, 
Oh, it's nothing. I've just been having these weird dreams lately. I keep hearing this distant voice, like someone far away is calling out to me. It keeps getting closer and closer, but just when it seems like they've almost found me, I wake up. And I keep having that dream every night. Kinda getting to me. I wish someone could tell me what it all means. Probably a reflection of something subconscious. Maybe you're just stressed over the future. It would make sense, since... Something going on? Looks like. Here, I'll go check it out. Seems like something's happened at the station. You should take a look. Alright, are we done screen tearing? Seems like it. Alright. Um, well, we could talk to a lot of... I don't really... Okay, just so you guys know. Unless I get something for talking to people. Um, uh-huh. I'm here to like entertain you guys. I'm sure a lot of you might like to see it, but we're gonna do a little bit of mix. Another murder. This one's just as brutal as the others. Oh, okay. Tire path is blocked off by a blue sheet. Doesn't look like you can pass hey. through. Heard someone got eaten. What's some kind of huh? wild animal? Try to get a look, but it's hard to tell. Blood everywhere, though. <laughs> I gotta record this. This is gonna blow up online. Oh, hi. My oh, brother hi, came back, but he needed to take a call or something. Walked off somewhere. Then Tao got a message, too. She went looking for somewhere quiet to try calling back. <laughs> uh, would you mind check? I know he's always looking after me, but I get worried about him, too. Thanks. I'll just wait here in case Tao comes back. Let's go check up on him. I guess we should save. <laughs> they said save often, even though nothing's going on. I didn't think about me going through these people. Interesting. Seems like he went this way. Oh. I gotta press A. I thought we were all working or walking home together. Oh no, her brother, I gotcha. I see. Making TikToks. Right. Great. So word on the street is a bunch of monsters have been seen hanging around this tunnel. Hey, there's D. Uh, yo! Sheesh! Ceiling's pretty low. Pretty dark in here, too. Looks dangerous. <laughs> I wonder why that road's so... Is it the bridge? Woo! It's like a little moped supposed to go through here. Alright. Enough screwing around. Let's go even deeper, yeah? I think we might be onto something big. Hey, what are you doing here? The worst place to be in an earthquake. Long, long ago, 
before these creatures known as humans gained knowledge. The God of Law seated himself upon the throne of creation. He sees all knowledge from the other gods, rebuking them, so they could never dare to approach the throne. Reducing them to mere demons. The fruit of knowledge was secreted away in a paradise of his own creation. One day, a serpent sought out the mortals, seeking to tempt them into doing his will. Eat the fruit of knowledge in this paradise, and you will become more like God. The serpent's goal was to revive the war of the myriad gods. Oblivious to the serpent's machinations, the mortals of each realm ate the fruit one after another, without fail. The knowledge they devoured then bound to their souls, birthing humans closer to gods. When the god of law saw this, he banished all humanity from his paradise in a fit of rage. Creatures infused with precious knowledge. Know that you are observed by countless demons, waiting for their chance to strike. I like how we go from being in a school to this. It's just so uh, drastic. But hey, anything to get into the uh, monster gameplay, the battles. Well, everything looks like it's been aged centuries, so looks like we're finally here. Yep, definitely a motorcycle thing, the little sign. Whoa! See ya! <laughs> what is going on? How can this be? A human walks among us. This is no place for one such as you. I shall grant you sanctuary. Fortunate an angel of Bethel found you. Were it an agent of chaos in my stead, you may not be alive. Remain calm and keep still. You will be safe momentarily. Thanks. Such a pal. Wow. That's kind of spooky. We were just looking for monsters. What we found were angels. I don't know where I was going with that. I'm just... They just like, force you in here. Like, you're here. Deal with it. <sighs> Mondays, am I right? No matter how many times you look, it's the same seemingly endless sea of sand. It's safe to assume this isn't a dream. You decide to move onward for now. Nice. Moving onward. Let's save it. That's what they told us to do. Okay. Didn't mean to do that. Just press some buttons to see what I'm allowed to do. 
Okay, that resets the camera. Happy to see you too, bub. <laughs> Go cross-eyed for a second. <sighs> Whoa. What's up? Young man. If you wish to live, take my hand. Okay. Not. We'll take his hand. Get to the point. Smack. High five. So easy. Huh, got a G-Mint. Fused with something, some proto fiend. Zap. known again after all this time knowledge and life have remained separate until now perhaps the future is secured light or dark you may chase whatever you please i shall await you in the realm beyond the earth and heavens Okay. Until then, may your newfound power guide your survival. All right, our first battle against one little demon, little imp. I think we can do it. Young Half. Man, can you hear me? Yep. You and I are now one. We oh. have ascended to become a being known as a Nahobino. A Nahobino. Our form is based on my own appearance, but your knowledge seems to be the basis of our consciousness. You didn't you didn't really look like this before. You were I shall obey your will. a lot bigger. Command me in battle. Okay. Player and enemy actions are governed by the press turn icon shown at the top of the screen. Taking one action consumes one icon. Select skills and choose an action to take. You got it. Tense battle. I'm just kinda looking at everything. We got a lot of options. When choosing which action to take, you can select skills, then choose to attack, heal, or support, among other choices. Choosing the attack skill will not consume any MP. All other actions, however, will cost MP to use. Observe each situation to decide the best approach. Well, what about zip zapping this guy? Might as well, right? No, I'm not allowed to. Okay. Hiya! Take that. Each skill has its own affinity, and demons typically have weaknesses to certain skill affinities. Targeting a demon's weakness will deal damage as well as cause a press turn icon to start flashing. This indicates that you have earned one additional action. Striking weaknesses and granting yourself extra actions can often lead to victory, so pay attention to the skills used. While well, I was trying to do that, I figured... Step. Alright, we flash it now. A flashing press turn icon indicates one additional action. You can grant yourself extra actions in a fight by targeting enemy weaknesses. 
If only you told me this previously. On the other hand, missing attacks or having your attacks nullified will consume more press turn icons than normal. The same rules apply for the enemy as well. Target enemy weaknesses while defending your own in order to maintain the advantage. What if I just keep zip zapping him then? Enemy turn. I think a normal attack should finish him off, right? Easy peasy. So we get, it looks like three extra monsties. Hopefully. Wow, there's a lot going on here. Um, Icon help, huh? Cool. Fire, ice, electric, force, light, dark, almighty, status ailment, healing support, special, passive, miracle. Item icon, stat boosting item, consumable item for glory, relic, key item in essence. All right, here we got the uh, icons for what they're weak to. So we got weak, normal, resist, uh, half, null, drain, and repel. Status ailments, incapacitated, sleep, mirage, poison, confusion, charm, seal, mud, and shroud. Additional effects. So we got some nullifies, we got some attack up. Looks like two ranks. Same with defense and accuracy. And then we've got the negative. Uh, we got repel physical, magic, absolute evasion, damage down, phys charge, magic charge, crit charge, recovery charge, pierce charge, successive strikes, taunt, magatushi skill, omagatuki, toki, I don't know. There's a lot of things. Essence icons, unobtained, in possession, not in possession, no essence, purchasable. Demon hunt icons, special conversation, subclass. Wow. So it looks like we nullify um, lightning. We are weak to force. We do the happies on whatever the religion one was. And we're weak to the shadow. Neato. You leveled up. A lot of your earned points to build your strats. Uh oh. I have to do this? I bet we can do different things. Um... Well, of course, we can do different things, but I mean different builds. All right. Agility increases chance to gain initiative, escape rate, hit rate when attacking, and evasion when attacked. Luck increases probability of chance-based results being in your favor during battle. Probably not a bad thing to get. Vitality reduces damage when attacked by enemies. Increases damage of magic attacks. Increases damage of physical. Pretty straightforward, I would say. Um... I feel like if we're going to be using... Do I go more magic based? More physical? I don't know. Let's get a magic. It's only one. Hopefully I can't screw him up. All hostile targets eliminated. That was a horde of demons hunting you for your soul, young man. Mm, what's mine? This place is what is now called the Netherworld. Oh. Correct. Demons? Descendants of the gods of old, known now as demons. Furthermore, this is home to the demons. The Netherworld. Okay. But do not worry. Here, up. I, Protofiend Algami, am here to assist you. Together, we have become a being known as a Nahobino. This new body should allow us to fend off the demons. Let us keep this form until we reach a safe location. I'd like you to go here, as it should help us get a better grasp of this world. Okay, we're gonna go right there. Pressing select will display the map, which gives us a much wider view of the area. This can prove useful when the mini-map isn't giving you enough information. Also, if there's a specific location you want to aim for, you can set a marker on the map. Also, I'm going to hit say select. The menu button, actually that starts and I take that back. That's the start button. I know on the Xbox they call it completely different things like menu and like something else, but... Interesting. Okie dokie. We will continue.
Auto heal. Oh. The Nahobino can move at great speeds. Hold L trigger, right trigger, and use L to dash. Pressing them at the same time will allow you to dash without holding an input down. Try moving about freely to your destination. Whee! Nice. You seem worn out from that last battle. I, I actually am not. Perhaps you should gather some Magatsui. Magatsui. Gazuntite. This world is filled with Magatsui. Brimming with spiritual power, it is the source of a demon's strength. The lights you see around us are the crystallized forms of Magatsui. Hmm. What? Young man, can you not see them? No. Perhaps you aren't accustomed to your new body just yet. Focus and try looking okay. again. I'm gonna try. Hey! Oh, I thought we're looking, not closing our eyes. Oh, we're just blinking. Ah, there they are. That's a lot of Magatsui. Were you able to see them? Yes, those are Magatsui crystals. Magatsui. Boy. Magatsui can give us strength as well. If you see any, don't hesitate to claim it for yourself. The three colored lights that can be seen on the map are called Magatsui crystals. Green crystals restore health. Yellow restores MP. Red crystals store Magatsui, which is needed to use special attacks. Okay. Da, 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 da. Do we miss any? No? Okay. Whee! Kind of hard to see in the sand. I feel like I'm Sonic. Considering I haven't fallen through the uh, floor yet, this is a better game. You'll come across various obstructions as you traverse the world. Pressing B will allow you to jump over these obstacles. Try jumping over them. Okay. I guess so, if you insist. hi -ya! Okay, so we can just jump. Nice. I had to unlock the bound feature. <laughs> Climbing points. Okay. I know how to play video games. They're all pretty much the same thing. <laughs> Hopefully there's like secrets and stuff once we uh, get more into it. Whoa, someone rolled a d20. The golden objects you see on the map are treasure boxes. These can be destroyed with now being no sword attack. So whenever you see one, Try both approaching it with the axe. Ooh. Always look behind you, kids. You never know what might be be there. Might be be there, huh? You heard me. Hiya! Five hundred maca. I'm guessing that's money. Yep. Oh yeah, they called it money up there. Wee wee wee. Huh. Just like home. Observe, young man. This land is known as the Netherworld. This isn't Tokyo? I've heard that this place was once known as Tokyo. But that time has passed. Now it is the Netherworld, a land dominated by demons. Hmm. I'm afraid I lack the data needed to answer your inquiry right now, young man. All I can remember is that there was a battle here in days past between gods and demons. Two great forces clashed right here in front of Tokyo Tower. I know this because I was there as well. Despite this, however, the data containing my memory of what followed has been damaged. The only other memory I have is of my mission to protect you. Seems like the Aogami character can't explain any further. Young man, perhaps we could make our way to Tokyo Tower? If we return to the last location in my memory, I may be able to remember something else. The Lay of the Land. As you progress through the main story, a quest may naturally trigger. These are called main quests. Main quests are different from the optional subquests and must be completed to progress the story. Ooh. Yep, this is Sonic. Let's go. Escape from the city. Hmm. Hmm. After comparing this blue pillar of light with my data, I have concluded this is a ley line fount. What did you call me? A ley line fount is a point from which the Earth's energy overflows. As one might surmise, it holds incredible power. 
Not only can it heal those who touch it, but it can also instantly teleport one to nice. another location. This is an anime. Considering the damage sustained in your previous battle, I recommend you verify its healing capabilities. Okay, we'll verify. We'll see how it goes. Boing! <laughs> well, you're a peculiar one, aren't you? No, I wouldn't say so. I'm a human. Nice to meet you, though. You're the peculiar one. Really, now? You want to know yeah. where you are? <laughs> Why, this is the place I call home. Nice. Nice home. As you can plainly see, I'm a bit of a collector of sorts. It's easy living. What with the riffraff out there and me in here. <laughs> Still, a demon like you's a first. One body, sure, but I can sense two spirits within, no doubt about it. <laughs> Pleasure having you. What a knee slapper. Gustav, keeper of the cadaver's hollow boss of the me man. Thank you. You may call me Gustav. See something you like? It's all yours. For a small fee, of course. <laughs> okay. Nice to meet you. So, off to Tokyo Tower, are we? I like after the little video because it doesn't look like it's being rendered. It doesn't look like it's being rendered in the game. It just looks better afterwards. Kind of funny. I wonder if they're using like the Switch's videos. <laughs> A favor and make a purchase. All right, you got it. <laughs> Twisted my arm. I'll sell you what you crave, as long as you got the maka. Give yourself an edge against the demons, why don't you? Oh, okay, why didn't you say so? <laughs> Let's see. We got lots of things. We got medicine. Revival bead. Okay, they're pretty straightforward. Glass. This plays info for one foe. It's a hundred bucks, though. Do I? It says fifties. You're out of fifty, so. Hmm. Well, guess we should buy some medicine. We'll buy you can some. Buy it. Yep, that's what I said. Say thanks. Maybe we'll buy two of these. You can say thanks. Nothing to buy there. Okay, just consumables. Else. Nope, I'm gonna go. <laughs> Satisfied your curiosity, have you? Allow me before that, however... I couldn't help but think our meeting like this must be fate. So perhaps you can do me a favor. I'm rather taken with the human knickknacks and relics of yore. So I got some pawns to go out and fetch them for me. Mimon, they're called. Trouble is, oh. they're fickle, and even worse, forgetful. Oftentimes, they give up the search and do whatever they please. <sighs> Useless. I'll take him down. That said, if you happen to run across any, mind sending him back old Gustav's direction? I'll see to it you're rewarded. <laughs> Also, I've taken liberty to connect this place to the Leyline Fount. Feel free to come and go as you fancy. <laughs> Till next time. <laughs> that guy, the voice actor, oh, yes, of loving course. it. Here, allow me to show you the. I can okay. use the flow to heal you if you fancy. Thank you. I can't do it for free. <laughs> Oh. Up a little Lame. However, I'll... The cadaver's hollow has been unlocked. Recovery has been unlocked. Leyline found... Ley founts can be found throughout the netherworld and provide services such as healing and traveling to cadaver's hollow. Other services will become available as the game progresses. Leyline Ley founts make for good checkpoints when exploring the netherworld, so be sure to activate any that you come across. There was an unexpected meeting but we were able to confirm the Fount's capabilities. As we make our way to Tokyo Tower, 
I recommend we look for the Mimon, as we were asked. You got it. Ooh, DLC for buying the game. You obtain Haredo Bead. Thanks. You've obtained Gleam Grenade. What the heck? We can save it. Alright, what what is that? Let's check that out. Gleam grenade. Weak almighty attack to all foes. Item is not consumed upon use. Very slight recovery to all allies during battle. Item is not consumed upon use. Huh. Okay. I'll take it. Skills. Oh my god, Turkey critical. Mega sushi. <laughs> Mega sushi. All attacks, including magic attacks, will become critical hits for all, all allies for one turn. Magasui Spring. Slight MP recovery for all allies in the active party when the Magasui ga gauge becomes full in battle. And get off these notifications. Head to Tokyo Dow. Alright guys, we're going to actually end the episode here. I know that the first episodes of these are usually not filled with a lot of exciting things, but I'm excited to see where this continues. We can see a little dude that way. Maybe it's one of those Mani or whatever. Uh, but if you played the game, you can always give me tips, uh, hints, whatever. But never spoil anything for me. Um, not a fan of that, but I don't mind tips. Even in just... Anything you can think of, like maybe you should build this way or look forward to this. Maybe there's a missable item. Who knows? But anyway, I'm Nathan. Thank you so much for joining me on this demon adventure, and I will see you.